that were long that my mom decided she wanted to throw away. And I am the rescue recoverer of all drag. So I said, give them here. And it was because they were so long, they had like um, dead ends because when you wear synthetic hair down on your shoulders, it um, singes up with the heat. Um, so, be it that she never brushed it out or nothing, it all kind of clumped together. So I cut the clumps off of the wigs and sold one on top of the other. And this wig is the result of those two long, ugly wigs. Now I got one beat wig. I don't really know what this wig is, if it's like um, gospel Dorinda Clark Cole or whatever, but it give me that. It give me, it could be Jesus, it could be Slatasha. It could be Auntie Bernie in the back who just figured out what color is for the first time in her life. <laughs> it could be. I like this wig. It's fun. I don't know if I wear it in the summertime because it is too hot ass wigs. And it's a lace front. So I ain't got nothing to worry about as far as the look. Honey. She's laced down. Maybe that's why I need to do, bring it out my face more, right? Why are you not talking to me? Are you taking me here? <laughs> I'm really talking to you. She like, I'm listening. Because we're not still taping. <laughs> Especially when we start getting into the wig looks. Okay, yeah. I have a lot of wigs, though. A lot of wigs. I just refuse to throw them away. Unless it's like unsavable and unsalvageable, I will always live for my wigs. Okay.